A digital revolution began in 2008 with the emergence of Bitcoin, conceived by the mysterious Satoshi Nakamoto. Imagine a currency that exists only in the digital world, beyond the control of governments and central banks. This was Bitcoin's promise, a decentralized peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system. Bitcoin transactions are recorded on a public ledger called the blockchain, maintained by a distributed network of computers. This blockchain ensures transparency and security, making it nearly impossible to alter or counterfeit transactions. Miners, using specialized hardware, solve complex mathematical problems to add new blocks of transactions to the chain. This innovative technology promised to revolutionize finance by offering faster, cheaper and more secure transactions across borders. Early adopters saw the potential to disrupt traditional financial systems and empower individuals with greater control over their money. However, Bitcoin's journey was not without its share of disagreements and divisions within the community. As Bitcoin gained popularity, debates arose about its future direction. One contentious issue was the block size limit, which restricted the number of transactions that could be processed per second. Some argued for increasing the block size to accommodate growing transaction volume and improve scalability. Others believed that maintaining a smaller block size was crucial for decentralization and security, fearing that larger blocks would favor large mining pools and corporations. These disagreements led to intense debates and ultimately a split within the Bitcoin community. In 2017, the Bitcoin blockchain underwent a hard fork, resulting in the creation of Bitcoin Cash, or BCH. Bitcoin Cash proponents advocated for larger blocks, aiming to increase transaction capacity and compete with traditional payment processes. However, this was just the beginning of the forking saga. The Bitcoin Cash Fork itself experienced further divisions. In 2018, another hard fork led to the emergence of Bitcoin SV, short for Bitcoin Satoshi's vision. Led by figures like Craig Wright, a controversial figure who claims to be Satoshi Nakamoto, BSV aimed to restore what they believed to be the original vision of Bitcoin as outlined in Satoshi's white paper and early forum posts. BSV proponents argued that Bitcoin had deviated from its intended path becoming too focused on speculation and digital gold narratives rather than its potential as a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system. They advocated for even larger block sizes, aiming to facilitate microtransactions and enable the development of complex applications on top of the blockchain. This commitment to large blocks and a specific interpretation of Satoshi's vision set BSV apart from both Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash leading to a complex and often contentious landscape within the broader Bitcoin ecosystem. While BSV shares a common ancestor with Bitcoin and Bitcoin Cash, several key differences set them apart. The most significant is block size. BSV boasts significantly larger blocks than both BTC and BCH, aiming to accommodate a higher volume of transactions and enable more complex applications on its blockchain. Another key difference lies in their philosophical underpinnings. BSV proponents argue that they are the true heirs to Satoshi's vision, emphasizing on-chain scaling and the development of a single stable protocol for various applications. In contrast, BTC focuses on security and decentralization as primary values, while BCH emphasizes peer-to-peer -peer cash functionality. These differences have led to varying levels of adoption and acceptance within the cryptocurrency community. While BTC remains the most widely recognized and valuable cryptocurrency, BSV has carved its own niche, attracting developers and businesses interested in its unique capabilities.